Hello everyone, I'm your host Kikyo, and welcome to Sonichi add-on, the town itself. Sonichi, a nice lovely port area that was heavily infected, er, affected by what was going on in the Berezino city region. As people panicked, didn't know what was going on. And were being forced to evacuate their homes, just like the residents of Berezino. It became a nightmare. Uh, I do remember that links to the Discord and the server name will be put in the description. Please come join the server. It is growing every day. As we see an evacuation bus hit a poor van with zero survivors a real shame we we'll turn into the Sunichi market area a cop car is blocking the road as another vehicle almost rammed right into it seems like the cop car hit the fence a real shame now, whatever affected the residents of Berezino also affected the residents of Sonichi. As we can see, a mass grave right next to the medical center. A disturbing sight to see. And it also be next to the well. Another disturbing sight to see. Workers from the Sunichi Quarry use a truck to attempt to evacuate, taking a load of wood with them. Maybe the safety, maybe to block the road. Don't know what was going their minds. They were just told to evacuate the city of Sunichi. So they did. Loading their workers up into the truck and driving it down the road not getting far at all as they crashed over here and blocked the road more panic ensued causing problems as a convoy or a fuel truck carrying fuel for his gas station hit a car down there causing major confusion over there. It was a real shame. As the cities of Bears, you know, and Sunichi were forced to evacuate their citizens. But what could happen? What is this disease that is making the Infected, per se, kill their own loved ones. Another panic in sewer crashed right into that house, not making it far. Only if you think the fates of these two cities are bad enough, wait until you see the fate of Kami Shovo. And it's bad over there, on that coastal city. It makes Sunichi and Bears, you know, look like a happy, lovely miracle that they had to deal with. But more in a later episode. As we come to the coastline of Sunichi, we see this weird camp that was set up here by people. Survivors, per se. How long did they survive? Only time new. As it looked like a supply truck over there was causing some trouble. Or had some trouble. From who knows what. Military encampment, maybe? No, these survivors were a lot worse. Bandits. 
the local Sunishi bandits caused some trouble for people evacuating. These people did not want to leave their homes. Who could blame them? As they came to the coastline and set up some defenses on the planet Sinesco, hoping they could defend it from the undead, the local military, the local police, Spetsnaz, and even Delta Force. These bandits did not last that long, as most of them, unaware of it, they were infected with this unknown disease. Those who succumbed to the disease, most of them died. It was unclear if anyone became the undead in that camp. Oh, shame. As they were causing trouble for panicked, unarmed civilians of the Chernoruskin Republic.